In order for a woman to think she truly love a man or like a man or interested in a man, she have to feel like she can lose him at any minute to another woman. That's why when men are quiet or nonchalant or not giving strong interest, looking at her in the eye a lot, having moments of quiet, gentlemen, my blue pill brothers or any brothers or beta males, whoever, even alpha males, whoever, we have to remember sigma males, real unaires, real pills. You have to remember, don't be scared to have moments of silence around, silence around a woman. Have uncomfortable silence, especially around a woman you're really attracted to. Because the higher attraction she feels from you, the more she's going to think you're not going nowhere and she can do better than you. If you become a fan, she's going to treat you like a fan. But if you act like you're on her equal or higher, she's going to reciprocate more energy and interest towards you. Because you're not kissing that boom, ba boom, ba boom, boom, boom. So, gentlemen, do not be scared to have moments of silence and gap moments of silence. Especially when you're talking to a woman on a, on a date or you're at it somewhere, just have moments of silence. Give her moments to say, what is he thinking? If you can have moments of silence around a girl and don't act like you're trying to force words and you got to try to impress her, she going to, interest level going to bake because most women, their nature wants what they can't have. Women nature want the forbidden. So you have to remember that. Most women nature, they want the forbidden. So you got to understand. <laughs> That's how it works. That's exactly how it works. So a lot of guys, they want to ask, you know, I, I, you know even though I, I'm a natural born alpha male. I, I, people was calling me alpha male or sigma male before. They were saying alpha male, but I come to find out, I think I'm more of a sigma male. Um, I'm, if y'all always see me alone, right? I, I know a lot of people, but I'm always alone. So I'm most I'm probably a I'm probably a sigma male. Um, you know, I used to always feel like you know. I like this girl. I don't like moments of silence. I don't want her to think that I don't like her if I was really attracted to her. And I, I realized that that was kind of turning women off. The moments of silence is what attracts them the most. I tell a lot of my clients that the, mo the moments of silence is what's going to get you where you want to go with a woman. You're going to get the best out of a woman in those moments of silence. If you don't let a woman imagine, if you don't get a woman a chance to imagine or think or get curious, if you give her everything, expose everything to her, you're gonna get in the friend zone, or she's just gonna de she's gonna depart. She's gonna get away from you. She's not gonna um, find you interesting, and then she's not gonna make no time for you, and you're not gonna you're gonna stay blue peeled. And blue everything. <laughs> everything on you gonna be blue. Everything on your body gonna be blue. So, my advice to you guys, man, uh, set up a consultation with me, and tell me what type of girl you're interested in, and we can work something out. We can we can solve these problems. But if a woman feel like nobody else wants you, she don't want you. If a woman feel like nobody else wants you, she don't want you. You got to understand that it's like a video game. You beat that video game, you don't play it that much no more. You may not never play it again. But that game is giving you a hard time. You, you're so curious, man. You trying to figure out what? Why is this game? Well, I got to find out the codes. What can I do to beat this game? You, you, you're looking into all this stuff because you wanna, you're curious to see what's next. And that's how these women are. You give them one word, Texas. You see what I'm saying? You give them one word, Texas, here and there. You know what I'm saying? Don't talk to them much. And you'll see. You'll clearly see. You'll see that 
you'll see how her interest go up. But you keep blowing her up a lot of texts and stuff like that. That's why you just focus on what your goals are. Stay close to God. Put your energy towards God first and foremost. And date more than one woman. You know, but with, do something to take up your time. You know, don't put all your energy in one good-looking, gorgeous woman. There's billions of them out there. And every day a woman turn 18, legally. Every day a woman turn, a girl turn 18. So you, that's, that's legal. There's women all over the world that's flying to the U.S. right now or flying to your city or London or Africa or wherever you at, flying to India, Australia. Every day somebody is moving where you live. And they'll love to have you. You just ain't met her yet. But she's coming. Just be patient. I know it seems like, man, you know, a lot of you guys got a high sex drive like me. And you want that girl with the smooth skin and the nice smooth, nice smooth backbone and a small waist and all that. But she gonna come. You just gotta wait, man. And stay doing your thing. Stay on your purpose. Stay flirting sometime when you... When you're going A to B, you ain't got to run after her or cold approach, but stay active in communication with women in crossing to where you're going. You ain't got to search and go make a day out of running, but wherever you go, when you see women cross your path, sometimes God work with your path. You got to go here today. You got to go there. You see what I'm saying? And uh, that's just how it go. You know, God works like that. You know, he works in how, you know, in, in your passing. And, you know, it, it might be somebody in your path that you got to get. And that's how it go. Next thing you know, you're talking a, a good amount, two or three, four females, you know, that um, that's quality, that you like. And then you can start weeding them off later if you want to make one your main girl or the main girl you go out with and stuff like that. You know, and you ain't got to meet up with all the girls that fast. Like, you know, I used to meet a group of girls and try to meet up with them real fast. You ain't got to do all that, man. Once again, you want to save as much money as you can because, because what happens is dating can get expensive. And you can use that money towards your business, towards uh, investments. Ten, they got ten dollar investments online. They got uh, all kind of investments you can put for ten to twenty, fifty dollars, hundred dollars. Man, all that money can go to something that benefit you, where you ain't have to keep spending money on women that's gonna give you a little, little hug like this at the end. You ain't got time for all that, man. You ain't got time for all that, man. You know. So just. Focus on yourself. Don't give women that much energy. Remember, you are gold. You are valuable. You Got to make yourself hard to get. Can't be so easy to get your attention. So easy to get your text back. You have value. People got to be worth your time. They got to be worth you. If anybody can get you, they think you can be quality, but if they feel like they can have you, they feel like you easy, they're going to go into the next guy that may not be that as quality as you are, may not be good in the bedroom, may not be alpha as you, may not be strong as you, but they're going to treat him better than you because he came across as hard to get than you. It's a sad game, but that's just how their minds operate. It's a very sad game. But that's how they program with the, the, the devil's the devil's woman's nature has programmed them into uh, has programmed them into treating you into a, a being attracted to the forbidden. That's all. Anyway, I'm Alan Williams, the millionaire. You can set up a one-on-one -on -one consultation with me if you want. We can do a live video check. We can talk about whatever you want, whatever's on your mind. Whatever situation you're going through, don't forget to press that like. If you felt you like you something reached you, something you like, press that like, press the subscribe button, check out the next video, hit that bell, and you'll get notified ASAP the moment another video get placed.
Remember, I love you, but Jesus love you more. Reading that nation, we out.